Hello, good evening. Hello. Hello, good evening. Hello. 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 Can you hear me? Yes. Okay, good evening. How are you today? I'm great. Okay, that's very good. So this time, let's start with our new lesson today. So our lesson today is still listening, okay? So please don't forget because today we have our vocabulary, okay? Okay, so still we have our feelings, right? So, okay, go. Please listen carefully with our vocabulary. Can you hear me clearly? Calm down. Calm down. Again, how to read that word? We have our calm down. Okay, what is the calm down? Calm down is to become or make somebody yourself become calm. Yes, to become or make somebody. What have you understand about calm down? What have you understand about calm down? What have you understand about calm down? Calm down. Do you understand that word? Hello, Mark. Hello, Mark. Can you hear me? Yes. Hello. Please participate. Yes. Okay. What is calm down for you? What have you understand with that word? It's a physiological state of the Oh. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's very good. So next, please listen carefully. The second book. Revise. Sorry. Revise. Okay, go read that. Revise. revise. Okay, revise. So this is the meaning of revise. What is that? Is to change to change your opinions of Plans. Okay, to change your opinions or plans. Okay, next. 
Advice. Advice. Okay, what is that? Advice. Okay, can you please read the meaning of advice? What is a suggestion about what somebody should do? Okay, very good. That is advice. Refuse. Refuse. How about refuse? To say that you will not do this thing that somebody has asked you to do. Okay, so to say that you will not do something. This is ST, that is something that somebody has asked you to do. So that is you will refuse if there is someone asked you. Okay, next. How to read that word? Is important. Yes, that's appointed. So what do you mean by disappointed? Upset because something you hope not happened or been as good, successful, etc. as you expected. Okay, this is etc. as you expected. So that is you disappoint something because you expect also, right? So next, what is this? Anxious. anxious. Yes, anxious. What do you mean by anxious? It's really worried or nervous. Yes, it's feeling worried or nervous. Next, what is that? Decide. Okay, that is the decide yes that's very good so what do you mean by decide to think carefully about the different possibilities that are available and choose one of them okay that's very good next relief to yes. remove or reduce an unpleasant feeling of Pain. Yes, that is relief. Next. Panic. What do you mean by panic? It's a a sudden mm -hmm. feeling. Sudden feeling of great fear that cannot be Controlled and prevents you from thinking clearly. Yes, that's very good. So that is the panic. Okay, next. What is that word? Take a breath. Is to stop doing something for a short period of time to rest or to focus once. In like energy, energy, energy elsewhere. Okay, next, what is that? Embarrassing. Okay, that's embarrassing. What do you mean by embarrassing? It's making you feel shy and comfortable. Okay, next. Make an ex excuse. excuse. Make an excuse. Excuse. Make an excuse. Make an excuse. Make an excuse. Again, ex an excuse. Excuse. Okay, what do you mean by that? Is to offer an apology for. Okay, there we go. So learn this. So here, um, what is this? Learn this should. Okay, can you please read that? No, no, no. We do. Okay, wait, wait. Okay, we we should go. We do should. For an advice 
or a suggestion. Example, your hair is too long. You should get a haircut. You shouldn't to advise not to do something usually because it is bad or wrong. Example, you shouldn't tell, tell your letter on to the street. We often use think ATC plus should. Example, I think she should speak to her friend. For the negative, we use I don't think should not. We should borrow money. So here, learn this should. We use should for an advice or suggestion. So meaning should, so you must do, for example. So suggestion is, okay, this example is a kind of suggestion that when you say your friend, uh, when you see that your friend has a, um, too long hair, so you must advise him to, to have a haircut. So next also, it is easy to see an advice to the other people, right? So for example, uh, you can see, um, what is that? Um, he has a locking project. So you will advise that you should make your project. Okay, so we use shouldn't not. So not um, as what we remember that is a negative, right? So to advise not to do. So you know already what is not. Do not do that. Not, okay? It's only because it has bad or wrong. Just remember that not. The meaning of not that is bad or wrong or that is not good, okay? So next, you shouldn't throw your letter on the street. So, okay, just always put in your mind the word not. Should not or shouldn't is the same. Should not is a long word. Shouldn't is a short word for should not, okay? So that is why for the negative, we use I don't think plus should. So I don't think, because this is a negative, I don't think we should borrow more money. So that's it. Okay, so negative, I should think. Um, positive, that is should. Okay, should not, that is do not do that. Okay, so here, look at, describe the photo. What are the girls doing? What are the girls doing? Okay, what do you think? What are the girls doing? Look at the picture or describe the photo. Look at the picture. What can you see in that picture? What are the girls doing? Go, please answer. What are the girls doing? What are the girls doing? Hello, Mark. Hello. Hi. Yes, please answer my question. What are the girls doing? Just observe the picture. What do you think what they are doing? Okay. 
she is causing a girl. Mm -hmm. And then, how are they feeling? What do you think? How are mm -hmm. they feeling? Sad. What? How are they feeling? As you, you can observe in the face. What do you think? What is the girl this? What the girl is? Or what does the girl feeling? Um, this one first. Look at what is that? What do you think? Just on the um, what is that? Guess your answer. Look at, what can you see in this picture? Look at the girl. Just observe. They what are the, sad. Yes, the girl is sad. And how about this in the second one? Here. So what do you think what the earth? So let's move on. Okay, what are the girls doing? Okay, in this picture as you can see the girl is sad right and there is another girl so lately we discussed about advice right so maybe the girl has a problem right because she is sad and then there is a girl who helped that girl okay so um the girl the blue girl advises the black girl okay so that's okay so here also another girl a woman is sad because of this black girl is sad. So what do you think they are saying? So maybe the girl said that do not be sad. Okay, just cheer up. Okay, so here let's have read and uh, the listening strategy and the three summaries of the dialogue below. Then listen to the dialogue. What is the best summary? Okay, please listen carefully because we have listening strategy. You do not have to understand every word in a listening task. Please listen carefully. You do not have to understand every word in listening task. Focus on a general meaning. Okay? Focus on a general meaning and try not to be distracted by words you do not understand. Okay, this is a listening strategy. So this time, please listen carefully. Oh no, there's no audio. This is our problem. Wait in a minute. Okay, so uh, all we have to do because we don't have any audio, we must have to read the transcript and then um, we will come back um the question, okay? So, I am Tom and you are Jack, okay? Are you ready? Yes. Okay, hi, Zach. Do you fancy going in the town? I'm sorry, Tom. I can't. I need to do some reading then. Revision for what? The exam next month. But they are six weeks away. Now, that's only two weeks for each subject. Look, I'm making a plan. This week is math. Next week. Okay, okay, calm down. I can't. I always do badly in exams. I want this one to go well. I need to study. See you later. Hang on. Why do you do badly in exam? You always study a lot. I don't know. I panic. I suppose. I suppose. 
Exactly. You panic. You need to stay calm. Take a break from your revision. Come with me into town. And then you can get back to your revision tomorrow. Well, I don't know. Maybe you are right, so. Great. Come on, then. But actually, I really want to finish this revision plan. Let's go out tomorrow. I'm busy tomorrow. Well, maybe at the weekend. I really think you should stop working for a bit. I'm sorry. Look, let's speak soon. Okay, it's your decision. Okay, this time. Oh. Mm -hmm. What is that? What is the best summary? A, B, or C? Okay, go read the letter A. That refused to go out with Tom because he disappointed about his exam result. Okay, how about letter B? That is anxious about his exam and designed not to go out with Tom. How about the other C? Is real real life that his exam are six six weeks away and our agrees to go out with two. Okay, what is your answer? What is the best summary? What is the best summary? Okay, the best summary is letter B. Jack is anxious about his exam and decide not to go out with Tom. Okay, so as what um, you remember, you must not focus the word, but you must focus the summary. Okay, here says what Jack do. I use don't and phrases below. Okay, go read that. Okay, read, please. Calm down. Finish his revision plan. Stop revising. Stop revising. Revising. Go out with Tom. Revise tomorrow. On Tom soon. I think, don't think that should calm down. I think that should finish his revision plan. Okay, I think Zach should finish his revision plan. So here, listen to the four dialogue. Match the dialogue to the sentence. Oh, still no. The person with a problem. Okay, can you please read that? Read only because there's no audio. Still no audio. Okay, number one. Read number one. Accept. An offer of help. Number two. Yes, that's a lot of advice. Number three. Is empowers to ask for advice. Number four. Feels bad because a friend is cross. Number five. Feels an offer to help. Okay, here, look at lesson again. Okay, dialogue B, C, and D complete the collocations with the verbs below. So wait in a minute. Still. So here in dialogue A, make a plan, take a break. Well, okay. How about uh, dialogue B? 
Just try to answer. So we already answered the dialogue A, right? Make a plan, take a break. How about let us, uh, no, number three. Just try to answer. Number three until number eight. Go, please answer number three. Hello. Hey. Okay, go. Try answer number three. Write your answer, please. Just choose your answer here. Just try. Give, have, make, take, tell, tell. Go. Please answer number start with number three and tell number eight. Go do it. Wait me two minutes. Okay, I will give you five minutes, not only two minutes, but five minutes.
Okay, let's check your answer. Okay, go read number three. Okay, go read number T and uh, number three. Check often. Give the body a call. Tell the truth. Have a word. With the body, make an excuse. Okay. So this is our dialogue A, B, and C, D, right? So just always remember also in this word because this is a very useful every time when you read. This is always, um, what is that? A partner, okay? Make a plan, take a break, take offense. Give somebody a call, tell the truth. So that's always a partner, right? Have a word or have a word with somebody. Make an excuse, tell a lie. Okay, this time, okay, we have steel. Okay, I am Madison and you are Louise, okay? And I am Matt and you are Emma. So, hi, Louise. Are you going to watch the match? You're Louise. Well done. I'm happy of your problems with mine. I can't think what to write. And the match starts in 20 minutes. Oh, the story project, yes, I finished mine this morning. Can you see my slide, the transcript? Yeah. Okay, your Louise, go. This is a role play, go. Please read the Louise. Well done. Go, can you see it? Well done. Well done. I have a few problems with me. I can see what to write. And the match starts in 20 minutes. I know. I can regret the much. Then we can watch it together when you finish your project. Mm. Again, hmm, I'm not sure. Go. Hmm. I'm not sure. I think I need to take a break. We can watch the football together here. But you have to do the project sometime. Why don't we look at it together now? We can make a plan for it, then you can finish it fairly quickly. That's not a bad idea. But to be honest, I'm a bit bored. With it, come on, let's go in the living room and turn the TV on. Are you sure? I always like to finish my schoolwork before I relax. I know, but we are different. Come on. Well, okay, it's your project. Hi, Hi Emma. Matt. Okay, I am Matt, you're Emma. Oh no, I am Emma, you're Matt, I mean. Go, can you do it? I am Matt. 
Can I ask John advice about something? Sure, Matt. What is that? You know my friend Toby. You know my friend Toby? Uh, yes, yes. Well, he's really angry with me. Oh dear, what? Why? Why is that? Well, I wrote something on his Facebook page and he didn't like it. Oh no, what did you write? Not telling you. It was just a silly It was just a silly joke. And he didn't find it funny. Exactly. In fact, he really took offense. I said sorry and delighted the comment, but he's still angry. What should I do? I feel so bad about it why don't you give him a call and chat about it i tried that he didn't ask for well why don't you text him you have to keep trying i know you're right i can't give up thanks for your advice okay i am zoe Hi, Ryan. You don't look very happy. Is something wrong? Well, yes, it is. Actually, can I tell you about it? Sure, go ahead. Well, I saw Brandon yesterday and he told me about this girl. I mean, I mean she's called. Go on. Well, he really likes her. He want to ask her out. He talked he talk about her for us. So what's the problem? I asked her out last week and she says yes. Did you say that to Brandon? No, I didn't. I couldn't. I don't know. I'm in Paris. He really like. Oh, I don't want him to get cross with me. But you can keep it a secret. I know. What can I do? You have to tell the truth. Hmm. But it's difficult. Do you want me to have a word with him? 